welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Brandy Gibbs. I'm back with my May favorite, so let me get started. Okay, the first product that I'm gonna share with you is from Pixi by Petra, and you can find this at your local Target. And this is a makeup fixing mist. This right here, it has rose water and green tea in it, and it's just one of my favorites. I like the smell of it. I like to spray my face when I feel like my foundation is a little bit like ashy. It's a, a great product and I like this. And another product that I like to use for oil control and to set my foundation is the D Slick Makeup Setting Spray and this is from Urban Decay and I purchased this at uh, Target and this is 30 milliliters which is like one fluid ounce. This is not the actual big bottle but you can purchase the big bottle. I need to because I ran out and I just opened this one up. I had a backup. All right, so let's go to the next product. This is the Garnier Skin Active. This is the Micellar Cleansing Water, and this is all in one. It removes makeup, even your waterproof makeup, and this does the job of taking off my mascara, taking off my eyebrows. It does a great job at taking off all your makeup, and it's good for all skin types. And someone asked me, did this uh, contain oil? And it says no oil, alcohol, or fragrances. And I have the Mario Badescu Skincare. This is the Glycolic Foaming Cleanser and I use this in conjunction with my uh, Clarisonic Mia. It's a little wet because I used it this morning but I like to use this in the morning as well as the night just to take off all the good, the makeup, the dirt, the grime off of my face and it works really well. I'm um, almost out of this product but I'm going to pick up another one and you can pick this product up at Ulta. Next for foundation, I've been loving this Clinique. This is the Stay Matte Oil Free Makeup Foundation in the shade 21, which is Cream Caramel. This is like my go-to foundation when I'm going to work or just like lounging around and I want to put on a cute face. I like to uh, use this. And I like to set the uh, foundation with this Makeup Forever setting powder. And this is in the shade 209. It's the Makeup Forever Dual Matte. Let me open that up. Here is the powder. I'm almost out. I've been using this for a while now. I like this uh, used together. I was using the one from um, I was using the one from Mac Mineralized Skin Finish in Medium Deep, but I didn't like the way it made my uh, face look. It looked a little ashy, and I was using uh, a lot of this product. And I think if you use too much of this. You know and your de-slick and everything i think that uh for as far as me and my skin i will start looking a little bit too greasy so um yeah i just switched on over to the dual matte and i've been loving the finish that it gives me okay okay let's talk about brows my favorite brow product is the myx michael brow and this is in the shade sometimes i'll use chocolate sometimes i'll use brunette espresso it really doesn't matter as long as i have this pencil this is just like my favorite and i'm using it now on my brows and i also like to set my brow with this model in a bottle this is a long lasting eyebrow sealer and i've had this for a while and it it's gonna last a long time guys this is a great product and i noticed um through sweating uh wiping my face my brows stay in place so I like that product and I, the next product that I'm going to share with you is the concealer from NARS this is the radiant creamy concealer these always go back to this now I tried the LA girl pro conceal and this is a great product but I noticed that it doesn't last as long as the NARS that's just my opinion but I do like to use this and this is in the shade fawn I like to use this underneath my brow so this is the LA Girl Pro Conceal and you can find this at like a beauty supply store. But these two, I picked this up at Sephora. These are my favorite concealers to help my under eyes. And the shade that I have is Caramel in Amande or Amand. Next is the Becca. This is the Ever Matte Poreless Priming Perfector and this is a sample size. I've had many of these and I've been using this a lot. I've been talking about this product a lot. Some people were like, what the heck is Becca? But I've been using this uh, for a long time and it has really did the job. And I like to use this. It makes me feel comfortable when I'm wearing my foundation that I won't get as greasy as um, I would if I didn't use this primer. Um, it's a great product and it comes out, I'm sure you guys seen this before, 
but this is how the product looks and you just I don't work it in like this I kind of like dab it on my face my face until it feels tacky on on the skin now let's talk about mascaras I've been using the Chanel and this is the Lee volume de Chanel number 10 in black I've been using this but when I went to Sally's and I seen this which is the femme couture line and it's called fake lash and midnight black I haven't even paid any attention to this this and lastly I have three lip products that I want to share with you all the first product is this Mac pencil and this is in the shade plum this is one of my favorite lip liners this is just like a go-to I use this with my nudes I'll use it with um, my pinks this pencil right here it just gives me life and for my lippy I like the melted matte and this is from Too Faced and this is one of their liquefied matte longwear lipsticks in the shade Queen B and I have that on today but I topped it with Max let's see Max Orange Tempera lip gloss so I just use these today to make this little lip combo but that's my favorite lippy and the last lippy that I'm going to share with you is from Chanel and it's a glossomer and it's in the shade 179 and the name of it is called Mure Mure it's a very pretty pinky peach and I'll swatch it for you and it looks really really pretty right now on camera it looks a little sheer but it's like long lasting and it gives you a great moisturizer make your lips feel real nice and moisturized and it looks really pretty on hey guys so those are my favorites I thank you all if you lasted this long in the video thank you thank you thank you I will see you in the next one really soon until then have a blessed one bye bye I got one more item and this is the Diane Von Fossenberg and these are my favorite shades that I like to put on sunny outside yep so now that will complete my favorites I thank you all for watching see ya